is up YouTube this is Alex from the VGC video games crew and today I have another mod for you so here we are back at the mod shed and uh, inside holds another mod I got off of Minecraft DL so let's go inside and see what that is and we have two many items mod so it's a very simple mod uh, many people have had it at least once in their life of having Minecraft, and uh, it's very commonly known mod, known worldwide practically. Anybody who plays Minecraft, and um, very popular. A lot of people download it, and I have it for almost all my videos. It's actually how I make all the stuff. So, it's actually there's no crafting recipes. There are no new blocks, and nothing really in particular. Anything new. But the unique abilities about this mod is what happens in your inventory. So when you press E, this is your average inventory. But to activate to the items mod, all you gotta do is just hit O. Once you hit O, you are gonna have a huge list of all the blocks and items in Minecraft. Uh, and you even get all the potions from here as well. Every single item that exists in Minecraft, you have here. Now, right-clicking the block will only give you one piece. But by left-clicking the block, you will get a stack of 64. And by shift left clicking, you will get an unlimited stack of 101. This will never run out, even in survival. Oops. Actually, yes, it will. In no, yes, no, it won't in survival. You have an unlimited stack of anything you want. So you can basically just do whatever with this. Anyway, other than these cool features, um, it also adds in in creative mode and in here it also adds in the item number as long with it so the wood here is five it also shows it in here as well before it wouldn't do that so also the other features of too many items mod is this over here this is really cool tabs up here one of them is the delete mode if you just click on that and then click on any of the stuff in there it'll delete it not only that if you drag an item in there it'll delete that block that's in your hand also, even if you have a splat load of stuff in your inventory, all you gotta do is just hold shift and click it, and then all the stuff in your inventory will disappear. Um, now this little bug there where everything in here disappears, but trust me, it'll go back the minute you just do that. So, not only that, you can also switch your creative mode. So right now my creative mode is on, but creative mode is off, and there you go. With just a click of a button, I'm in survival mode. You can also control the rain, which should start any minute, and there it goes. You can also shut it off. And yeah, there it goes, it's off. So it's really cool. Not only that, you can also control the time. What else does this mod do, isn't it? So let's go see the time. So right now the sun's positioned over there. I want it to go to sunrise. So sunrise is right over there, and you can see the sun rising. Right over there. Now I want it to go to noon. So noon the sun will be positioned right above me. And then, I could also go to Sunset, which would be over there. And finally, what I can do is that I can change it to Midnight. So, all those features with this mod could help you a lot. Especially if you're one of those people who are in desperate need of stuff. And, of course, this mod could be used in many ways for very dirty cheaters. And if you're if you're a really bad dirty cheater, you know, I just have my legitimate world right here. You can just make, you know, a little secret chest and then stash some unlimited sources of diamond in there. Uh yeah. And no no and nobody will ever know. Blow up anything for all you want with all that oh, other leftover TNT you got there. <laughs> yeah, take that survival mode. So now let's go see how to install this awesome mod. Installation for the PC Windows and Windows XP. Alright, so now we're on to the installation for a PC. Um, all we're going to need here is our Too Many Items file, which I'll have linked in the description to the Minecraft DL. So, once we have that, we can move on to the installation. So go down here to your start, search a program file, type in percent, app, data, percent. Hit enter, 
and then it should take you to your roaming folder and bring you over to here. <clears throat> go to your .minecraft folder and go into your bin. Now, right here in this empty space, right click, hit new, and hit create folder. Name it backups. Since I already have one, I'm not going to do that. So, once you have a backups folder, just simply right click your minecraft.jar, copy, go into your backups folder, and hit right click and paste. So, once that's done, you should be ready for the installation. Now, before we go into your adult Minecraft, we need to make sure we have a new jar so it's fresh to install. So, to launch your Minecraft game, go to Options, Force Update, Will Force, hit Done, and then log in. Now, go all the way back to your percent updated percent. So, that means back to your start, search program file, percent updated percent, roaming folder, dot Minecraft, into your bin, and wait right here because we need to make sure that this game is closed. So, it needs to be done loading and then we can close it. So, I'll pause the video until it's done loading. Okay, now that it's done loading, all we gotta do is just go down here and quit game. It'll exit your Minecraft for you. Now we can move on to the installation. So go here to your Minecraft.jar, right click, open with WinRAR Archiver or any 7-zip opener. Open that up, go back here to your bin and exit out of this. You're not gonna need that for now. Take your Minecraft.jar and drag it to the right. Now, before we move on to anything else, we have to make sure that meta inf is deleted. So just go, go ahead, right click, and delete the files. Press yes, and you should be ready to now move on to the installation. So take your too many items file, right click, open with Winner Archiver or 7-zip opener. Then, next out of that, drag that to the side, and all we gotta do is just click on one, hold control A, which will highlight all the files, click and drag, and then bring them all into here. Add, press OK, and you are done. So now, let's go see if it worked. So let's launch our game. Let's log in and let's see what happens. So hopefully you don't get black screen. Alright, I didn't get a black screen. Now let's go into a single player, go into any world, and here we are. Now all I gotta do is just press E and there we go. So two the items successfully installed. So um now we should move on to the Mac installation where I'll move on to Nick. Installation for the Mac Mac OS X and all versions of Mac. All right, so now, so now we're going to move on to the installation for the Mac. So Nick will take us along that. Nick? Hello. So you have to first download the Too Many Items mod. Then when you do, you search Too, oh, too Many Items. And see that right there? Download that. I mean, open that, sorry. And then you'll get all those files right there. Okay, well now... To install it, you're going to have to go to User, Application Support, Minecraft. Then you're going to have to go to your bin. You see your Minecraft? Oh, you see your Minecraft.jar right there? Well, you're going to have to make. You have to rename it to Minecraft.jar.zip, and that will let you open it. And it will say Keep Jar, or Use Zip. You have to use Zip. Okay, and then it looks like that. Then you open it. Just double click on it and when then when you open it you have to you'll get a folder like this right there and and there's all these files inside that's your minecraft that's inside your minecraft gotcha now you're gonna have to scroll down before anything and delete meta inf because that make that like um you have to delete that or else you can't install the mod okay deleted that now I'm going to take the too many items I'm going to drag all these files into my minecraft.jar hit replace done and you have a mod installed okay go into that right there and the uh, things you get with the uh, too many items. And thank you, Nick, for showing us the too many items mod and how to install for a Mac. Anyway, guys, a uh, whole bunch of quick updates right now. One of them um, that old um, Mice Workers mod video. I am really pleased with the amount of views I'm getting so far. So um, I got um, 
good likes on all the videos and I'm doing really well and I really want to thank you guys I even got a subscriber because of that video so um thanks to my little buddy Nick over there Nick say hi <laughs> anyway so and he drops out of the call anyway but I'm really really excited guys there are many more mod videos to come on and hopefully a lot more uh, adventure maps that I'm gonna do soon um I'm gonna start a new build and uh yeah so thank you guys for watching this video like rate subscribe leave a comment do whatever you want it really helps me out thank you guys very much and i'll see you guys next time